The crowds are back at Summerfest, and this time they've come with an appetite. You can kind of eat a little bit of the world while you're here. Without even leaving Milwaukee, people stood in line for Middle Eastern food and Filipino food, among many others, to get a taste of the world. Giving people something different and unique to try is awesome as well, too. Tai Tai's truck owner Matthew Alfaro beamed with excitement as he served up authentic food. Seeing all the people together, food trucks and everything, like this reminds me of a summer in 2019, which is so much fun to see. The first ever MKE Food Truck Festival is a partnership between Milwaukee World Festival Inc. and On Milwaukee. Organizers such as On Milwaukee senior food writer Lori Frederick say it's an opportunity to get back together. Our intention was really to, to do a gathering in the summer as soon as we could. There was great demand from food trucks um, in terms of, you know, we got as many as we needed for the event and there were, you know, 12 more that would have participated. Milwaukee resident Jake Burkle says he couldn't miss out on the 17 diverse vendors present. Milwaukee gets a lot of heat but for like being segregated, but you come out here and you don't see that. It's very diverse. There's lots of countries represented. It's an opportunity to feed off each other's energy. It's awesome to see how this has come full circle and everybody coming back out to enjoy the food. While finding a new cuisine in the city and helping a local small business rebound. Uba Ali, TMJ4 News. So to give some context here, in a normal year, five major festivals would have happened by now with Pride Fest and Polish Fest in June, Summer Fest at the end of June, beginning of July, and Festa Italiana and German Fest in July, followed by, of course, the State Fair in August.